AS, 100 year old house, 40 ounce firebird, coming at you another fucking video. Do another strange beer tasting, this would be number six. And I got Holstein Mailbach, it's from Germany. It's 7%, it's strong beer, which as we know is in Canada is malt liquor. Comes in a 16 ounce can. Let's see what she's like. Good crack. Usually means it's fairly fresh. So it's supposed to be a blonde nail. Let's give her a go. Not bad. Fairly smooth. It's got kind of a citrus tinge to it at the end, kind of like a hazelbison. If you've ever had that, which is a lemony orange taste. Definitely goes down smooth. Doesn't seem to foam up too much, even though I do have this very chilled, but it's not too foamy. Which means it's not over carbonated, which is nice, not like a Sleeman's or anything like that. Which is way too carbonated. It doesn't matter how cold you have it, it does foam out of the top of the bottle usually. <sighs> Extremely smooth. I've already threw half the can. Stop a couple of pulls. Oh, what's new? Well, I'm working security again. That last video I posted up, the two board cam video, just in case anybody's following us chronologically, was from about three weeks ago before I got a new place. It was an old one. That was more of a repost. It hadn't been posted yet, though. Oh. Oh. There we go. Oh. Got some kind of fucking night on the can. Some kind of shield crest. I don't know how well you guys can see that. My lighting is probably a little crappy right now. I'm kind of shooting this pretty quick. I gotta get up for work in about seven hours. Near the staff meeting. But anyway. I drill this shit in you. Not bad though. I'm giving it about a seven or eight. It's pretty good. Nice and smooth. Price point's pretty cheap on these two. They're about two fifty a can. Tall cans in Canada. It's fairly cheap. And all my buddies down in the states are managing to score freaking forties for fucking two bucks. I don't know how the hell they do it down there. You're fucking lucky bastards. Anyway. Big cheers to Falstaff Brewing Co. and Ranchero 302 Me. Come with buddies for a while. Keep up the malt liquor videos there, Falstaff. They're looking pretty good. And you're right, Bruce has been slacking a bit. But you know what? That's what happens when you have a life. Sometimes you got business you got to take care of. Everybody has the luxury of making a malt liquor video every day. Wish I could myself. Pretty smooth. Not bad. I'm a big fan of Heath Bison beers myself. I find they're very tasty. I don't know if any of you ever tried raspberry ale. It's extremely good. It's in the same family. Normally not a big fan of fruity or light beers, but this isn't exactly light. That's pretty freaking good. I wish they had this in 40s, but unfortunately they don't. There goes the swill, swill, swill. And that's all she wrote, folks. Till next.